Hello. Here is a tip for those of you who often find bars and graphs on the screen don't always populate correctly. You can see here from this trace, this is a speed trace, a GPS speed trace, that we're not capturing all the data on the screen. Uh, sometimes as well, you can see here in the default mode that uh, the system has added some minus brake pressure here just to be able to render the graph properly, but it's actually cutting off the top uh, of, the, um, of the chart. And so one of the things that I like to do here is the first and foremost is the simplest approach. If you go up to the left hand side on the axis and where it turns into a hand, if you double click with your mouse, the first thing that it will do is it will change uh, your graph and fit it into the, uh, the screen size that it's allocated for that particular measure. So you can see here now, uh, everything's available and can be seen easily. However, if you do that down here, and you double click, nothing changes. And that's because this is the default that's been set uh, by AIM. So if uh, knowing this is my brake pressure channel, if I scroll down to brake pressure, which is down here, if I right click on the brake pressure area here, I'm going to get a series of options that will show me uh, the data as it appears. And so what I can do here is now I can change what the, um, what the axis and the measure is looking at. So I don't want to see minus uh, 50 I'm gonna put in minus 10 that just cleans it up a little bit uh, that is there you can also see that now if I click apply and exit that has now moved uh, and it's easier to see that but what's interesting is is the maximum here is 250 but here it's saying the maximum brake pressure is 255 so I just want to go in and edit that again again right click go in and say I'd like this to now read 260 and you can change it to say 260 apply and exit and now you can see that as you scroll in here, you can see your information in an easier fashion. So if you ever find yourself in a situation where the data is not rendering properly, first and foremost, give it a double click. Otherwise, you can easily go in and change many of the settings on the measure. But in essence, the easiest one to change for better view is to change the scale. There you go. Thanks very much.